So, hello. This is my um, Orion Starblast 4.5 EQ telescope. It is my first telescope and it was around $200. And I've been very happy with it, but there is a design flaw that needed to be fixed almost right away. So, I'm going to show you what that is and um, what I did to fix it, maybe save you some headaches down the line. Okay? Okay, so here we are. We've got a, a, a great beginner scope with one lousy component that was making it a little bit frustrating to use the first couple of nights I went out. And that is um, these slow motion cables for, um, for right ascension and declination. They are just not designed with the highest quality components. And so while they're easy to grab in the dark, um, the, the problem is this set screw starts to back off a little bit without you touching it, without you doing anything to it. The more you use it, the looser it will become. And it will back off to the point where um, you can see I've got a lot of slop there right now just from backing it off of the flat area that is um, that you'll I'll show you here in a second on on the um, on the, the mounting shaft here but at some point you're going to be playing with this all night long you're going to have to keep going back and making adjustments and it's just not it just doesn't make for a fun night so anyways I took that off I, I know that you can glue that on there I know you can epoxy it or you can loctite it I'm not crazy about making a semi-permanent change or even a permanent change to my equipment that way. I'd rather uh, find something that I can change out later on if I decide to do that. So here you can see the little notch that she's shooting for in the shaft. And Ed Ting on his channel, um, he's been very helpful and I, I reached out to him about this and he suggested that I look into getting um, basically a volume control type knob. Um, these are potentiometer knobs and I'll leave a link um, as to where I bought these. But um, if I, um, I'm going to put this on here, and on this particular scope, I believe it was a 6 millimeter. it'll be on the description anyways, um, is the size that I bought, and um, what I have found very early on with using these is that I have had these out for um, hours now, and I have not had any issues with them coming loose. Um, they stay very, very solid, and um, I have not had to tighten one since I put it on. So, huge, huge difference, like night and day. The only trick is, or the only thing that it's not great about it, is that you don't have this big cable sticking out. So, reaching around for it in the dark, you have to kind of get used to, okay, where is this? Where is this in related to, in relation to where I'm standing, where my scope is? And when you replace both of these with these smaller knobs, it's going to bring everything in, and you're going to have to kind of like, you just basically have to learn where they are in the dark. That's not a big deal. I mean, you're already doing the same thing for your locks. So... To find these minor adjustments, um, that minor inconvenience is well worth not having to keep tightening things down. So um, that's my quick solution on that. All right. Thank you. Clear skies.